at the pumpkins. They have the Georgia ones for the football team. I don't even care for football, but I'm excited for football. Really cute and comfy and just like my sweater. I have like my Hawaiian shirt on and then I have like my... Let's see what's in it. Hold on, I'm gonna show you guys. Thank you so much, you too. They're size 13 and I want to get them, but they're so big. Hey guys, welcome to a vlog! If you're new here, my name is Brittany. Welcome to a vlog. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Please hit that red subscribe button. Join the fam, join the gang, be in there like swimwear. Those of you who've been down with me since day one, welcome to a vlog, baby. It is Friday. I'm so excited. I'm such in a good mood, if you can't tell. I'm such in a good mood because I don't know why. I've been having a, <laughs> I've been having a week. As y'all can tell, it's already Friday and I'm just now vlogging. All week, it's been hectic, y'all. School season, let me tell y'all, school season, it's been, it's been rough. <laughs> it's been rough, okay? My daughter has strep. It's just like, what's, what's going on with the germs, okay? Because my theory is this. They say, oh, you know, germs spread when everybody goes back to school. Now, who's starting it? That's what I want to know. Because it ain't my kids. My kids were fine during the summer. They weren't sick during the summertime. So if your kid wasn't sick during the summertime, your kid wasn't sick during the summertime, my kid wasn't sick during the summertime, who is spreading the germs? I'm starting to think they're putting germs in the school. <laughs> I'm starting to think they're putting germs in the school, then spreading it to the kids. I just don't, I just, you know. How y'all week been? Let me not complain, because someone said I complain. Which I don't think I complain, I just vent. I just tell y'all what I've feel and how I'm doing life and this is the real me but my thing is this here's the real tea why are you watching my channel <laughs> that's the real that's the question I want to know because I am never one to spread negative energy or speak negatively or give backhand comments because that's what it'd be it'd be backhand comments um because I can't stand the oh I'm just speaking my opinion type of person if your opinion is rude or it's condescending or it's backhanded I don't care if you're speaking your opinion. It's still, it doesn't negate the fact that it's negative. Like what, like what? People kill me with that uh, statement. But anyways, um, if you don't like me, sorry, my still wearing right here, I gotta pull up. If you don't like my content or if you don't care about what I say or if you, do, if you have an issue with what I say or you don't really care to watch me or like parts of you, like you like me, but you don't like, like just, don't watch me I guess I don't know what else to say like just don't watch me I don't, I don't um yeah I just don't say anything like I like if I don't like someone and or if I'm watching someone's content and I don't like them I'm not gonna say like hey I like you but you do this like that sounds like a you problem like that sounds like you should not be watching me anymore if you don't like it like I like to keep everything just cool calm collected and I share the real me with you guys I share the share the real that's going on in my life I don't mean to complain so if I come off sound like I'm complaining that's not what I'm trying to do I just I'm just here being me sorry but anyways we're in Walmart parking lot because I have to go to Walmart and yes I've been to the store every day almost <laughs> since I got off of work it goes work store work store work store Child, anyways but if you can tell from the titles of this video we are doing a lot of great things a lot of fun things i got some packages to open with you guys and share with you um macy got a package macy got a sponsorship a a a a so i can't wait to share that with you guys and then um also we're doing like a self-care type of thing because i neglect myself way too much and as a mom as a wife as a full-time work uh employee as a full-time content creator like i like because let me tell you this just because i have a job does not mean i stop content creating like i'm always on tiktok instagram i'm always posting y'all so who do you think is editing those that content me so i am constantly doing something 
but paying attention to myself and taking care of me. So we're going to do that, okay? I had to wait till my day off, but we're going to do that. We're going to take care of me. So let's go into Walmart really quick. Should I take you guys in? I mean, I feel like there's nothing in Walmart, but I just got to grab a couple of things. And I refuse to go to Target on a Friday night or Friday evening because it's almost 7. I refuse because the club is open. That's when the club open. Y'all didn't know Target turned into a club between the hours of 5 p.m. on Friday and 10 p.m. on Sunday. I don't go to Target during those hours. No, ma'am. So we're gonna go. I guess I'll take you in with me. Do y'all wanna see Walmart? I'm asking y'all like y'all can answer me. Mm, whatever. I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. Starbucks really quickly um, I have work this morning so we're gonna go to Starbucks I'm already here actually I'm at the grocery store I need to pick up a couple of things and I need to um, get my Starbucks so yeah happy Saturday it's the next day last day for work for me so it's my Friday I'm excited I got a splinter but let's go it is so nice out here like I love fall weather like oh my god look at the pumpkins they have the georgia ones for the football team i don't even care for football but i'm excited for football when it comes to fall they have the small ones and then they have these let's see welcome on it and like different designs and then they have the big ones so freaking cute <laughs> yeah Eucalyptus here. Oh my gosh, I'm buying it. How big it is. I know. Oh, I got these florals last year, y'all. These are the ones that I have, and they lasted me a year. And I have these ones too. How oh, pretty. And then these broom things always smell good, but I never get them. Okay, I'm back. It's much later. I do I look crazy because I feel like I look crazy. It's been a hectic day at work, y'all. Hectic day. Not complaining now. Not complaining. Just letting y'all know. 
but we have a special package to open. We, Macy should be here. We have a package from Love Every, so thank you so much to Love Every for sponsoring today's video. I have been seeing so much about this company and I have been wanting to get Macy um, like a play kit because she is in kindergarten. It's her first year in kindergarten and I wanted her to stay on the path of learning instead of buying like all these toys that don't teach much. I ended up going with the connector kit because that kit looks so fun and looked like it had a lot of sensory things that you can do. And the connector kit is for um, the 49, 50, and 51 month play kit. So I feel like that was right up Macy's alley. <sighs> Let's see what's in it. Hold on, let me show you guys. So here's how it looks when you open the box. And yes, okay, so the connector kit has like these um i don't know if you can see but it has these stations where you can put things together um this is like an explore pouch your child can wear this and explore things outside it has the um eyeglass where you can look under the examiner um it's just so fun like look how much is in here look at the pouch so cute it's a good size too um, and then it has so much in it, you guys, this play kit, so much, tons and tons of learning tools, y'all. I'm telling you, I'm so excited. I get to work with Love Every because it, they just have so much. It comes with a book too, as well. Macy's really into reading, so I'm super excited to share this with her. Super excited to read this book to her. This is part of like our bedtime routine, so I'm excited for her to have another book. I'm on break right now, but I'm going to put this together once I'm done. Oh, I cannot wait to show you guys. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, I love this. If you guys want to try out your own play kit for your toddler, you can go ahead and check my description box and click on that link. Make sure you shop my link for Love Every and try out a play kit of your own. Again, thank you so much to Love Every for sponsoring today's video. See you on the swing? Yeah, I'm going to get on the other swing. I'm going to do a flip. Yes, no I can do that. I can do that. Ow. Okay, guys, it's much later. It's actually nighttime right now. Macy's downstairs playing. I showed you guys she was playing with her love every toy. It is so cute. Like, it is so informative and it comes with like booklets and just shows you like how interactive the toys can be, but it's learning at the same time. I absolutely love it. I this is my first time trying out Love Every and I'm just so, so, so happy that I get to work with them. Macy's loving the toys. I just love it. It's not even like toys. They're like learning tools to me because each piece is a learning tool. Like they literally learn something from each piece that they sent over. So, so happy that they sent that over and Macy's loving it. It is so late. Work was actually really, really busy. And you know, I had like a stressful day and sorry if I'm complaining, but this is just me being open, you know, cause I go through stuff. I go through a lot and I try not to complain, believe it or not, even though I supposedly complain, I try not to because I wanna bring positivity to my channel and bring enlightenment and just be this happy little soul on camera but reality sometimes that's not how it is and I'm not even gonna get into like what I went through today or I'm not gonna get into like how I feel or what I went through but mainly because like it's it's not something I'm gonna let get to, get to me it's not something I'm gonna let put me down I'm just not even thinking about it but I will say this, y'all. Set your boundaries. I don't know who needs to hear this, but set your mother boundaries, okay? Set your boundaries. Because people will play in your face. People will try to test you. And the saddest part about it, it could even be family. It could even be family. It does not matter. It could even be family that try to play with you. And 
cross boundaries with you. Family do it the most because it's your family. Like, they'll do it the most to you. So, I don't know how you want to set up those boundaries, but just set them up. I don't know what that looks like to you, whether that's blocking people, whether that's saying no, whether that's, you know, saying no is a good start. That's a complete sentence. Um, whether that's, um, you know, not answering your phone as much, keeping your distance, but set your boundaries because there's nothing like setting your boundaries and not allowing people to overstep you, overstep your respect, just play in your face. There's nothing like that. There's nothing like people playing in your face. So, I'm not going to get into it, but set your boundaries even when it comes to family. Set your boundaries the most when it comes to family. Or that one friend that you got. Y'all know that one friend that everybody got that don't know their boundaries either. <sighs> Anyways, it's been a little stressful day because it was very busy at my job and then also like stuff that happened with me earlier, but we're back we're back and i actually want to share with you guys some stuff that i got from amazon all right on haul y'all so please forgive me because i opened up everything already but that's because i did a tiktok on my break so sorry but y'all don't really care about the unboxing right y'all just care about the try on <laughs> y'all just care about the try on right because um the unboxing y'all don't care about so i got some little outfits that i want to show you guys i was on tiktok and this girl did like these unboxing of loungewear and i was like i need some loungewear when i'm working from home when i want to go out real quick to do carpool i need some loungewear so this is the first outfit i'm gonna try it on but it looks like this it's a extra small no, I got a small. I didn't, the extra small wasn't available. So let me try it on real quick. Really cute and comfy and just like my sweater. I have like my socks on that I got from Target. So really cute, nice material. It's really thick. It's really thick. I don't know if y'all can tell, but it's like a really thick material. And my nails kind of match. I got these nails from the what line is that hold on i've been obsessed with these nails lately what are they called the olive and june olive and june nails i've been really obsessed with these they match so my nails match my sweater or whatever so i thought these were cute for like fall time anyways this is what we're talking about the set so really comfy cute first one no pockets but i don't know still kind of cute and very comfortable i can literally wear this to work which is right behind y'all <laughs> work is right behind y'all at my computer station or whatever so cute set it's a small but it has like this button detail um long sleeves again it's not super thin i mean it's thin but it feels warm i guess i don't know it's not like terrible and then the pants are kind of like flare like a small flare at the bottom really 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 cute and simple i can wear this at home but then i can also wear this out like literally just wear this out to target whatever going to the shops going to the stores real quick to wear this out really cute outfit so from home to the store this is like a cute loungewear outfit it's still cute it gives i like this because it has a slit but it covers the booty you know what i mean so it's not like I don't know. I think I like this. All right now, this one is one of my faves. It's so comfortable. Like, when I tell you guys, the fleece is so thick. Like, I don't know if y'all be able to tell, but it is, like, super thick. Not, it is fleece lined, so it is super soft. I love the sweatpants that have, like, the scrunch at the bottom. So comfy. Literally, my Uggs from last year. Um, the ultra minis and chestnut they are in such good condition because like I barely wore these like look at the bottom do you see how like clean they are these are a year old and they still look good so 
a little cute outfit like this. I have a khaki hat just like this, but it's in my Amazon cart. Cute and warm. Like this is definitely warm. For my mommies who go to the football games, the Raiders meets. I know I'm a Raiders mom, so I have to be out there in the cold early in the morning. So really, really cute. I love this. Like this is so comfy. Okay, the next thing is this like pull up that I got and it even has like the thumb holes. I guess this is like a Lululemon dupe. Um, it has the hood and it's like this really cute jacket. I don't know if it's like, it's like this really cute jacket. It's really warm, it's a pullover. It has like the pockets. This is so cute, I'm obsessed with it. Put on your little ultra mini Uggs with your socks. Cute, throw on a hat, I don't know. But this is like a pullover jacket. I'm gonna start wearing it immediately because it is so cute and easy to just throw on. I'm gonna be wearing these everywhere. So cute. Throw on my hat. This is like me, straight up and down. Mommy mode, straight up and down. This is how we go into the games, to the events, because first of all, it'd be so early in the morning when you have to wake up and you don't have nothing to wear. Just put this on hat cute leggings uggs and out the door that's how this is literally me don't be surprised if you see me in the same outfit y'all because listen this jacket is so cute i love the lining too and it is fleece lined i don't know if i told y'all it is fleece lined so so cute, I love it. So haul guys, everything is linked in my Amazon store. I got everything from Amazon, I'm so excited. I just wanted a, a few neutral like lounge pieces, I guess, to wear. But yeah, I linked everything below and it is on my Amazon store if y'all are interested. Throw the bundles up. Hey guys, it is the next day. It is self-care day, woo! It is self-care day, y'all. I don't even know where I'm going. Hold on, let me turn here. Oh, I could've went straight. Self-care day. Got my self-care club shirt on. It is self-care day and we are on our way to get our massage. I am running so late, like what the heck? I only booked a 30 minute massage and I'm running so late. I thought, I always overestimate myself when it comes to, no, I always underestimate, no, I yeah, I always overestimate and think that oh I'm gonna be on time because I can do this on the third but girl no you are not on time that's because I thought I could be superwoman in the morning I went grocery shopping real quick this morning I also cleaned my kids bathroom like I cleaned the toilet the shower I changed their shower curtain I mopped their floor like when I clean I clean you know I don't just wipe down candles I might I'm I sweep and mop floors all that so I just had to rush like I was just rushing and now I'm like kind of late for my massage I called them they said it was no problem they sounded really nice but I just hate first impression being um, late because this is my first time oh I'm going this is my first time coming to this place so I'm like dang my first time meeting on I'm late but it is okay we're going to go get our massage and then we're going to do maybe a little bit of shopping just look around to the stores low key i didn't even feel like after i booked my massage i was like i actually don't feel like going anywhere i actually just feel like staying home but i already booked the massage so it's just like i might as well go and i already paid half of it so i was like all right, all right i might as well go i could have rescheduled but no it's fine it's only 30 minutes and so hopefully they do good i've only been to um What's this place called? I've only been to, oh man, what's that place? Woodhouse? They did very good. I love me some Woodhouse. But I wasn't gonna go all the way out to Woodhouse today because obviously that's just too much for me. Like, I don't live near there, so I'm just, I wasn't gonna go all the way out there. But yeah, let's go. We're here. Let's go inside. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave my cup inside, but let's go inside. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Hi, how are you? I know, look, I know. Ugh, first appointment, I'm late. Ugh, sorry. 
It is so nice in here. Okay, where do I go? Oh. Okay. I am waiting in a waiting area until she come and gets me. Cause I am late, y'all. I'm waiting. It smells so good in here. It smells like uh, eucalyptus or something. Very calming. I'm immediately calm when I came in here. Because I'm telling you guys, it's just been a little stressful. Not my husband or my family, like my kids or anything stressing me out. But I tell y'all, watch y'all boundaries with family. I'm a little stressed. Okay, you're in the right place. Goodness, family's stressing me out. Oh, y'all, I'm back. That was such a great massage, let me tell you. Okay, I'm in the car again because I literally had to go to the store to get cash. Um, I used to be a lash tech and um one thing about these places that are like uh what are they called like franchise when you get tipped on a card you don't get that to your paycheck i love getting um cash tips because you know it's cash and i didn't have to wait for my paycheck so i ended up going to walmart and just getting cash back i could have probably went somewhere else to get cash back but I didn't know where to go, so I just went to Walmart. Because I know Walmart's like boom, boom, cash back, whatever. So, I'm not far, so I'm not, you know, I'm not far. This area that I, I'm in, you know, they have a bunch of shops and stuff. But anyways, y'all, I did not record my massage because one, I was late and I just felt awkward recording, even though she said that i could record i don't know if you guys heard me but i asked her can i record and she said yeah you can vlog i always ask so she said yeah but at the last minute i just went against it because i really wanted to enjoy my massage i did rebook um i did rebook with her so next time you guys will see me but this first time i was like let me just enjoy my massage I've been under a lot of stress and I don't know if you guys heard the conversation but she was asking me like what's you know what's going on where's your tension my tension is definitely in my back and my neck and my shoulders and that's what she hit so I was just ugh, so thankful so I definitely rebooked because y'all you have to like invest in yourself and I know I said that before on my channel but the mom guilt is heavy I get it but you have to not even mom guilt mom guilt and wife guilt girlfriend guilt whatever because you know you kind of feel guilty like you're not doing stuff with your husband or you're not doing stuff with your kids but you got to do stuff for yourself you you have to pour into your cup pour into your cup like you be pouring into that Stanley <laughs> pour into your cup like you be pouring into that damn uh, uh, mug okay got to pour into you so that's what I did Oh, that's what I'm starting to do. It's a small investment for yourself, but it does a huge impact. So, yeah. Now I'm going back because I seriously was like, yo, she deserves a cash tip. Some other stores I wanted to go to. <sighs> Some other stores I wanted to go to. And I'm just going to park here. And then I'm going to walk around. I forgot they had a bath and body works out here too. Okay, come on y'all. We're gonna go to some stores. Give this girl her cash tip and go into some stores. Okay. We're in H&M. My hair looks crazy, y'all. My hair is crazy because I was laying down getting my massage. Oh uh, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Are you vlogging? I am. I'm working, girl. I am working. So you're supposed to pay for the seven nine nine. Thank you. Thank you so much, you too. My hair looks crazy. We're in Target, y'all. As y'all can see, we in the fall decor. I found these shoes. Let me put my camera down. I don't care if no one watches. Um, I found these like UGG dupes that were on TikTok for the kids. They're size 13 and I want to get them, but they're so big. Macy wears like 11, maybe a 12. And then I got these, which I think will fit her. They're like 10, they're size 10. She had these last year. She gets these every year. So I don't know what to get. I'm gonna carry both of them just in case, but these are selling out so fast because they're on TikTok and like, they're so cute, so cute. me get my stuff and y'all silverware is nice cheese tools really nice i feel like target costumes will never be i feel like i don't know honestly guys i feel like walmart be having all the costumes am i wrong i feel like walmart costumes are way better than target costumes in my opinion I don't know, I just, every time I come here, they don't have a lot of costumes. It'd be all right. But it don't be a lot. And I just be like, okay. I don't know. Let me see what they got over here. They got adult costumes, too. And I feel like they always have more boy costumes than girl costumes. Definitely. Oh, they got a little ice cream truck. Um, I like the lights outside. I don't know if I'm doing any lights outside my home. I don't think so this year. I love when people decorate their house for Halloween. It looks so fun. This thing gonna move. All right, no. Okay. Oh, I, told you. I am not a jack o' lantern. This is my name. I got more pumpkins. I could have like gotten more pumpkins to DIY, but I'm honestly done decorating, so we're not gonna do that. We don't have that many baskets either. Like the baskets? That's all they have. We're leaving, we're going home. I'll see y'all there. Ah, y'all, I took a self-care day. My husband was like, Why are you back so early? But you know what to me is so funny because like I don't be gone long during my self-care days unless I do a staycation somewhere. Like, if I'm going on a staycation, I'm gonna go for like, I'm sorry, my hair is just all crazy because I was laying in that like massage thing. Okay, hold on, hold on y'all. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I would do a staycation somewhere and stay long there, but when I'm out and about, like, I don't really be out there in the streets. Like, that's not relaxing to me, per se. Like, I like doing shopping and buying myself some stuff. But driving, being in, like, the traffic, being around all the people, that's not really enjoyable. Even though it wasn't that packed today. But I really enjoyed myself on my self-care day. But, you know, I'm not going to be out long, if that makes sense. Because I like home. I'm a homebody girl. So let me show you guys what I got from H&M. I don't know if you guys completely saw, but I'm just gonna run through it. Um, I got this small puffer vest. This was only 26, 27, 26.99. It's not gonna look right because my shirt is like really big, but it's just like this small crop puffer vest. I love it. It doesn't really get hot in Georgia, so like jackets, vest, pullovers are essential because. It doesn't, I'm sorry, it doesn't get cold. It doesn't really get cold in Georgia, so puffer vests, shackets, um, pullovers, stuff like that is essential. So I got this from, uh, I was gonna say Old Navy, I got this from H&M, it's super cute. It's in this like stone color. Does it say what color this is? Oh, this is an extra, extra small. I don't even know. 
Well, now I'm glad I got it extra, extra small because I love the way it fits. Super cute. It's in this, I don't know what kind of color this is. I got this barrette. Y'all saw this barrette. I used to wear one of these when I was a young kid. Mind you, my mom used to dress us up like My Little Princess. If y'all know that movie, you a real one because that's like an old movie. But you guys know these barrettes, right? We used to like literally wear, okay. We literally used to wear these barrettes and we used to have our pea coats on and my mom also bought us these like fur things that you put your hands in and you walk like this and i only remember little princess when they had those things but we used to literally dress like that i wish i had pictures because we used to have pictures but i don't know where they went but we had like a lot of pictures of us growing up and that's how my mom used to dress me i got is these mom jeans these mom jeans are size four. I got them because I tried a size two and it was not going up my thighs. Normally I'm a size two, you know, I'm just petite, but yeah. I don't move up to the it. <laughs> but yeah, see it's the mom jeans straight. High waist, high waist mom jeans. Got to get the high waist mom jeans. Um, H&M jeans, and it still looks small, but hopefully I can fit it y'all because uh, I'm about to try these on, matter of fact, because, listen. Um, H&M jeans, I like because the back isn't bulged out too much. My back-to-butt ratio is off. Like, I'll have jeans that fit my thighs and my butt, but then right here in the back, it'll be, like, sticking out. I hate that. So, H&M jeans are good, and American Eagle jeans are good, and some Target jeans are good that doesn't have that big, like, opening in the back. Cause I am not tailoring nothing. And then the only thing I got was um, the boots from Target. I just went ahead and got these because I like, listen, I'm starting to notice y'all that stuff that I tell y'all about is gone. Like it be gone out them stores. Like those cookies, remember those uh, apple caramel cookies that I told you guys that so good from Walmart? Why are they sold out? Like, I don't like to gatekeep, but dang, like when you say something, just, just leave some for us too, y'all. Don't take everything. So I got the like cute little fake Uggs. I love these. These are only $25 from Cat and Jack. And y'all know once summer comes, you can return these boots after the kids have worn them out and get your money back. So I have done this so many times. Um, but yeah, these are the boots that I usually get for Macy for the summer or winter time. And they have like the fur in the inside. She will wear these down, okay? Because she wore these uh last year and the year before i always get these either i get the black ones or i get the brown ones this year i got the brown ones because she already has a pair of black boots how did these okay and then i got these i know these are going to be a little big on her so i'm just going to exchange them for a different size at a different target but i got the uh, slipper dupes from Target as well. So I got these that everyone was like ranting and raving about. So remember I was showing you guys and I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna get both. Why not? I just got both. So that's all I got. I got my massage. I'm about to make me a sandwich. Um, I put my oven on because I want to toast it, make me a sandwich, and relax for the rest of the day. Constantly everywhere. She doesn't keep them in. 
I'm about to close out this vlog, y'all. It's been late enough. It's almost 8 o'clock. I still have to edit. So I think I'm going to call it a night. There's nothing else to really do or show you guys. So thank you guys for hanging out with me, though. I appreciate it. Another vlog down, so I thank you. I think I do. What? Let me see. Oh, cool. Go, Macy. Go, Macy. Go, Macy. Go, Macy. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you guys have an amazing week. I love you all and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye. I you make I love my one time. Got tired of your shit, you almost too much.